Hey guys, welcome back. We have uh, we have another burg burglary. This time, armed robbery. Uh, the store was open at the time. We're gonna take a look at the footage. We're gonna we're gonna take a look at the uh, the chaos that ensued. I'd like to thank you guys for watching all these videos, sharing all of these videos, especially with people that are in the area. Hopefully, we can identify this perpetrator. And hopefully something like this does not happen again to these individuals or anyone else who is trying to run a game store. It's hard enough to run a game store, as is, in terms of overhead, in terms of making sure that you're making some dollars, that you're making a living, without all this other nonsense. I mean, there's nonsense, and then there's just armed robbery. That is the, that's what we're looking at today. Before we get into that, I would like to thank everyone for using the Rattle Pokemon link tree. You got lots of discount codes here. Support the channel at the same time while you're saving some money on some stuff that you're going to buy anyway, like singles, product, pre-orders, whatever you got to get from Troll and Toad with code Rattle5. And why not head on over to Card Market while you're at it? Pretty sick, nasty spot, uh, and uh, a great way to pick up some European exclusives if you're not from Europe. If you're from Europe, then it's probably somewhere you should be purchasing from anyway. But today, enough about that. We need to be on the lookout for this individual. Hopefully, we can identify them. It looks like there's a little bit of a collaboration going on here with a game, Pokemon cards, all kinds of fun, nerdy stuff. You got to like these stores. It's a shame that it it's so difficult for these stores to exist, so difficult for uh, for them to be successful, let alone when you run into issues uh, with the, uh, the shady individual. So let's open this bad boy up. We'll take a look at the footage, I guess, in a with the audio in a bigger scale. But I just want to get into the comments here first. We have Into the Retroverse who is saying, share this to the world. Everyone show them us fighting back and Alex standing up for everyone who's been pushed around and it really begs the question is this like a scenario where does a game store need to have armed employees and or the owner to make sure that you're not going to have somebody come in and steal all your stuff and threaten your employees with a gun is that is that what it's come to unreal uh, I can't imagine uh, a world where this should even exist. It shouldn't even be a question. It's insane to me that somebody is a shitty enough person to uh, <laughs> to rob to rob a game store, to rob a small business, is is just unreal. I, I you shouldn't be robbing Walmart or anywhere else either. Yeah, my apologies, but get a fucking job. Tough shit. If you don't have money, you're a very clearly a very able-bodied individual. Who has the ability to make some money in a legitimate way without robbing other people, getting violent and robbing other people. Here they say it to everyone commenting, thank you for the support. Please share the video and call California Pacific Management and ask them why they refuse to get an armed security guard for the plaza, why they are okay with risking high school students getting caught in the danger. So the, the mention for the high school is the fact that they get, they get a high school kind of right next to it. Uh, and I would imagine that a lot of the customers, a lot of the people that are coming through there are probably high school students. Now, regardless, this is not... There's, uh, Regardless of whether there's a high school in spitting distance or not, it, this is a, just a matter of public safety. It's a matter of the, people should be able to open a store uh, to make an honest living without having to worry about some wiener baby extreme coming in there with a gun, stealing all their stuff. Now, let's uh, let's take a look at the video itself, see if we can start it from the uh, from the beginning. Uh, and yes, we'll we'll see if we can get the the clearest picture possible of this wiener baby, and uh, and hopefully uh, there is some sort of punishment involved. I mean, it's insane to me that it isn't just time in prison for this type of thing. Uh, it should be if you're you're essentially coming in there, stealing from people, and then threatening their lives with a with a gun. That how how that is not you should be put away for a very long time. I don't give a shit if you were hungry and yeah, you needed to get some food and you decided you're going to steal. Chances are you, you would have just been stealing food if you needed food or if you needed something that was essential. You're looking for some money here uh, and you're stealing Pokemon cards. You go straight for the Pokemon cards. All right, let's check it out. I don't need more money What? I don't need more money so there, I believe he says, I don't need no motivation to do this or something like that. He, I don't know, he's mumbling like a pussy wussy. Buddy, what are you doing? I 
So the carnage ensues, um, and again, you're, there's like three guys in here. Uh, chances are you're probably not going to just out-wrestle all three of them uh, and steal their stuff at the same time. Fucking faggy, over here fucking Fuck is my phone at, bitch? Mm -hmm. We don't know. The fuck is my phone at, bitch? Mm -hmm. We don't know. So there you have it. Oh, we got a kitty cat. Uh, unacceptable. An unacceptable, uh, poor excuse of a human being uh, to be doing this to people, to be armed robbing a, a game store to get some Pokemon cards so you can make a quick buck, an easy buck, instead of doing something honest and making some money. Disgusting human being, uh, and hopefully and karma bites them right in the asshole, because that is... It's, it's disgusting. It's absolutely disgusting that you would stoop to that level. I, I don't have any other words for it. It's insane to me that it's ruining it for everyone. Clearly this person, I don't think this person is necessarily a uh, Pokemon enthusiast or anything like that. Uh, but hopefully they, they pay for their actions. So this is, this is gross. So here they are saying yesterday, this piece of shit comes in, goes straight into where the Pokemon product was and starts taking it. Unfortunately, we couldn't be here during the break in. If you're stealing Pokemon product as well, I, it's probably modern product that was there. I don't know for sure what, exactly what he was trying to steal, but I, I, I what what the fuck are you thinking? What are you what are you thinking? I guess like they probably understand that there's no armed security in the area. Like how you got a, a little fucking backpack? What the, how much money are you gonna be able to steal? Maybe if there's like expensive singles or something like that there. I I didn't see any. But at the same time, it's it's insane to me, like, that you would do this for that little benefit and do it to people who are just trying to run a small business. The entire thing doesn't make any sense. Her employees decided to step up until this coward pulls out a gun and starts acting tough. If anyone recognizes him, please, please let us know. We're going to have to see if there's some people in Colton uh, know where this individual is, know who this individual is. Uh, and uh, see if they can uh, get the uh, police department to do anything. But again, at this point, I, you're going to have to have some sort of security system uh, in terms of people. If people are just going to walk in and start stealing things right in front of you, and then if you try to fight them off or try to prevent them from doing so, then they pull a gun on you. Gross stuff, guys. Please be on the lookout if you know anyone in the Colton, California area, or I guess anywhere in California, and uh, and they happen to know who this individual is, reach out to me, reach out to the game store, and reach out to the police. Thanks for tuning in, uh, and hopefully the shop is all right. If you're in the area, I didn't see anywhere where they were necessarily selling online, uh, but if you're in that area and you can uh, and you can help them out, go buy some buy some stuff, buy some games. Uh, show them some support. I'm sure they could use it more now than ever. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for joining the Discord. Be on the lookout out there. Um, be careful. Be careful, guys. There's shitty people in this world, and uh, when there's money involved, I guess we do. We ha we have some we have some singles there. Shitty people. Don't be a shitty person. Let's uh, let's expose the the shit out of these shitty people see you next time bye